Hi, I'm Steve Friedman from Rockstar Excel, and today I'm going to talk to you about filters, or what I like to call Excel's easy button. Uh, now this is something that when I show to clients, it tends to completely blow their mind, because it's something that a lot of people don't know about, but it makes Excel so much easier, uh, and it allows you to work so much faster and more efficient and just makes you so much better at Excel with just one click of a button. So uh, here I've created some dummy data. Uh, this is some sales data for a chain of uh, retail stores. Uh, so we've uh, got here, uh, they've got three different uh, lines of stores or uh, they've got their discount store called Discount Products Inc. Uh, their mid-range store, the Stuff Sellers, and their high-end store, the 1% Emporium. Uh, they've got five different regions, East, West, North, South, and Central. Uh, then three different channels, uh, retail, uh, online in-store pickup, and online delivery. Uh, different categories of products, uh, including a blank here for ones that don't fit into a category, and then different prices. So say you want to analyze different things, maybe see how much they're selling in different categories, or maybe even uh, drill down deeper, say, you know, how many automotive pro or how much money have they made in automotive retail in the North region for the stuff sellers. Uh, you could do that in some complicated formulas. Uh, but again, there's a super easy way to do it with one but uh, with the easy button and the easy button is right over here. This thing that says sort and filter, uh, you know, it isn't labeled easy, but it is the easy button. So all you have to do is just hit control A to highlight everything and then press this button and hit filter. Uh, and what that does, you've got the, it adds these little arrows here to the top. Um, and then what you can do is click this and you see these little check boxes here. Um, so uh, by default, they're selecting everything, but you can just uncheck that, the select all, and then check the 1% Emporium. And now what you see is, uh, it's only showing you sales from the 1% Emporium. And down here at the bottom, it's telling you that out of the 999 uh, records, 360 of them are for the 1% Emporium. Uh, and then if you want, you can go back and either click select all here or click clear filters and it will send you back to everyone. Uh, you can also here, uh, you can just select blanks and then it will show you the ones that are blank. Um, and then you can add multiple filters. So uh, let's say we want to see uh, automotive uh, that was uh, online for the East region uh, for Discount Products Inc. So that uh, so then we see uh, here. You can also so that tells us that there are five only five that fit into all of those categories. You can also just if you click on that column down here, it tells you that it would the total is one hundred and seventy seven dollars sixty. Um, the count there, the reason there's a difference from this is because it's also including the label up here. So you want to look at this one. Uh, it also tells you the average. Uh, so that's super useful. Uh, another really helpful thing here uh, you can do is, uh, let's just, you can actually go over here and do, um, actually let's just go here and clear all the filters. Um, and another helpful thing you can do with this is, let's say you want to know uh, what were all of the sales uh, uh, excluding uh, online delivery. 
So you can just un unselect that and then see now not counting online delivery, you've got your total sales. So it's also a really helpful way to exclude things, uh, which is uh, a little more complicated and harder to do with formulas than to just uh, add up one thing. Uh, so yeah, this makes things super easy. Uh, and yeah, it's just something that is the really, you know, really makes things a lot easier. It's something I use all the time. It's something I recommend to my clients all the time. And again, it's just the easy button. You go up here, you go to this filter button and that is Excel filters. Uh, there's a lot more you can do with them, but I wanted to keep this a short video just to show uh, how easy this is. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's Excel filters. If you want to learn more easy ways to make Excel work for you, check out Rockstar Excel's Beginner to Rockstar class starting March 18th. Could winning in Excel win your next job or save you hundreds of hours as an entrepreneur? Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to increase your Excel scores 100% or more in four weeks. You'll be able to get twice as much done in half the time, amaze your boss and potential employers, and enjoy unparalleled job security. The difference between this class and other Excel classes is that in my 20 years of experience using Excel, I've found that there's a ton of really complicated things that Excel can do, but there's only a few really simple things that you need to learn in order to really become a rock star at Excel. Things like this filter button that make Excel easy uh, and allow you to be better than 95% of the people out there that are using Excel. You don't need to be an accountant or a data scientist with decades of experience. Uh, these simple things I can teach you in just four weeks. So whether you're an entrepreneur who struggle, struggles to finish everything or an employee whose career is stru stuck in neutral, or someone who's just looking to get be more efficient, organized, and get more done in less time, I can show you how Excel is the solution. You can, I can help you take minutes to do things that used to take you hours, or give you five extra hours a week. I can help you never have to worry about layoffs because you'll be the one that everyone in your company comes to for help. So uh, this uh, beginner to rockstar class is a really great class to help you put your career into overdrive or help you as an entrepreneur save a huge amount of time and be a lot more efficient and organized. It also comes with $700 of free bonuses. There's an Excel expense tracker, a behind the scenes video, a list of useful functions, lifetime access to a private Facebook community, a bonus session for people who've never used Excel, uh, recordings of the Zoom sessions for the course, uh, and for people who register for the early bird bonus, there's a free private 30-minute consultation with me. Uh, this course is being offered at a special uh, price of $297 for four weeks. This is the only time it will be offered at this rate. There's also a 100% satisfaction guarantee. If you aren't happy, if you don't feel that you've been increased your Excel skills 100% or more, I'll give you a full refund. Uh, also, you may be able to get reimbursed by your employer for this. Uh, a lot of employers offer reimbursements for uh, courses that build your skills. So check with your employer on that. And, then, and for you entrepreneurs, check with your accountant to see if this is tax deductible. I can't give you tax advice, so I can't tell you whether or not it is, but it may be depending on your uh, field and what your accountant says. So you can, uh, you can learn, list advanced Excel scores, skills on your resume and have it be true. Uh, you'll be the one everyone comes to for Excel help in your company. You'll get more work in, in, done in less time. You'll save five and save five hours a week. And again, this isn't for accountants. It's for normal people. Uh, 
so again, go to rockstarexcel.com to check out this course. It's a four-week course, and it's starting on March 18th. There is more about the course at rockstarxl.com. So I've been Steve, I'm Steve Friedman, and this is, has been How to Use Filters or Excel's Easy Button. Thank you very much.